Prince William has revealed the heartbreaking reason he is deeply concerned for his children's future. The Duke of Cambridge made an emotional plea in the foreword of a new book on conservation titled The Last Elephants. He highlighted how the number of elephants had dropped significantly from millions to thousands in the past 35 years. The 36-year-old wrote about how elephants will eventually be extinct at the hands of poachers, criminals gangs and traffickers. Quoting the Great Elephant Census, he penned, at the current pace of illegal poaching, when Charlotte turns 25 the Africa elephant could be gone from the wild. I'm not prepared to be part of a generation that lets these iconic species disappear and have to explain to our children why we lost this battle when we had the tools to win it. The foreword will appear in the book The Last Elephant which is due to be released next month. The Duke has spent a huge part of his life working to conserve elephants and rhinos affected by illegal trade in wildlife. Speaking at an event last October, William told 1,000 delegates from 82 countries how on his recent wildlife fact-finding visit to Africa he saw rhinos that were so threatened they have more bodyguards than I do. He told delegates, It is heartbreaking to think that by the time my children George, Charlotte and Louis are in their 20s, elephants, rhinos and tigers might well be extinct in the wild. I for one am not willing to look my children in the eye and say that we were the generation that let this happen on our watch. It is time to treat the illegal wildlife trade as the serious organized crime that it is. It is carried out by ruthless cross-border criminal networks. It is fueled by corruption. It damages economic growth and sustainable development. William explained some of the poorest people in the most vulnerable countries are being exploited. He added, Organized criminal networks are adding to their profits through involvement in wildlife crime. They see it as a lucrative and relatively low-risk activity. They are the very same groups who move drugs, people and weapons. These networks are sophisticated, coordinated, adaptable and professional. They innovate faster than we can and they exploit weaknesses in our systems.